Hello everyone, I hope that uh, you have a great day today. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you that okay, how to uh, use okay, uh, some kind of algorithm okay, uh, to uh, produce okay, a, a random uh, permutation of the numbers. Okay. So basically, uh, this is one of the homework exercises okay, I assigned and then uh, some uh, of you get okay, asked that okay, uh, Darasu, don't you know that I mean there is a function called a random dot sample and passing uh, parameter like this, and then you can immediately generate okay, uh, I mean uh, a random permutation list okay, for the numbers between one and ten inclusive. Yes, I know. Okay, so uh, let's see that uh, uh, what this uh, function can do for you. Okay, so basically this is the Python code. And then again, okay, let me uh, click okay, on the run, okay, and then boom, immediately it generates uh, the 10 uh, different permutation list. Okay. So yes, I do. Okay. But then the question will be, well, that's true. if you do uh, know that uh, there is a method to do that, then why okay, uh, we still have to learn about okay, uh, how to solve this problem without using that one? Well, here will be the answer. So here is the definition okay, of so-called know-how. Okay, from this uh, website over here, okay, uh, Merriam Webster. Okay, and then the definition of know-how is okay, the knowledge of how to do something okay so let me pause for a second second okay the definition of know-how is the knowledge of how to do something of course i mean uh, if it's possible smoothly and efficiently okay so there is the definition of know-how okay and again that's why okay that's why okay, i assigned okay, you okay uh, to do this homework, but I won't allow you to use okay, this uh, random dot sample method or no uh, NumPy. I heard that okay, uh, someone emailed me that NumPy has a similar function as well, because I want you to uh, have the know how, and that is how okay, a company uh, can produce okay, a better product okay, uh, than another one because they have a better know how. Or not just in science. I mean, all company have a better way okay, uh, to manage okay, uh, their business better than another company. Why? Because they have the know-how. So knowing how is very important. Okay. So for example, if I change the problem description like this, okay, if you are given okay, a list of let's say ten numbers like this, and I want you to generate the uh, different okay, uh, permutation, uh, random uh, uh, permutation uh, list. Oops, then you get stuck because this method won't work anymore. So, what do you do? Then again, you need the know how to do it. Okay, so this is the know how, and again, that's why in this assignment, okay, I don't want you to use. Okay, this okay, uh, random uh, sample okay, uh, function to generate uh, those okay, uh, random numbers or okay, random uh, permutation okay, numbers. Okay, all right. So let's see okay, how okay, uh, the it work. Okay, so again, know how is very important. Okay, again, that's why uh, you come to school. I believe that uh, all of you are very very smart, but okay, you need more know how. Okay. Okay, so let's see, okay, according to the algorithm, okay, over here it said, okay, make a second list and fill it with uh, the numbers, okay, uh, from 1 to 10. So assume that, okay, this is the second list and we fill it with the numbers, correct, from 1 to 10. And then it said repeat the following 10 times, okay, pick, okay, a random, num a random element, okay, from the second list, okay. And then remove it okay, and append it to the permanent list. All right. So again, okay, uh, we assume the uh, uh, second list. Okay, uh, let me change the, uh, the name here. Second. 
a single list we know the length is of now is 10 we have 10 elements right okay. and then above it will be the indexes okay, of each element so now okay we're going to do okay, something mentioned over here okay it said okay we got to uh, randomly okay randomly okay, pick an element so assume that we randomly get okay, pick the uh, um, uh, index okay they said seven okay so which means that okay, index seven will be this one and the value will be eight right and then we remove get okay, it and append it uh, or add the element to the permanent list so i'm going to okay, remove it and then add into the list over here okay so now okay the uh, uh the uh, second list has only one has only nine element and similarly the last index okay, will be eight only okay yeah and then okay, we have uh, done one time so let's repeat okay, uh, okay one more time so but here is it okay so now assume that okay, we render the okay, pick a number so soon we pick two this time right so index will be two there are two and two the value okay uh index uh, uh, index two the corresponding value is three so we get yeah, do the same remove it and then add into the list okay into the list okay and then get okay, again now the length of the first okay, uh, okay, of the uh, second list okay, will be only eight right okay, it will be only eight okay and then again the index will shrink as well and then again uh, we're going to get okay, repeat the third time so now assume that we randomly pick let's say uh, one right so the element corresponding to the uh, index one okay will be two so we remove it and add it to the list right add it to the list okay and then again get okay, now the uh, second list the length of the second list will be seven okay so the large index will be only six okay and then again we randomly get okay, pick uh, an index assume is one again so one again okay, means now the value will be uh, the value corresponding to the index okay, of one will be four so okay we remove it and add it into the permutation list and then okay, again okay uh, now the length will be six right the length will be six and the large index will be five and then again assume that this time okay, uh, the index we can pick is five for example so the value okay uh, corresponding to index five is ten so we add ten get okay, to the list get okay, to the list and then now okay the length of the uh, second list will be five okay it will be five so the larger index will be four only and then again okay assume that next one will pick index two okay so the value corresponding to index two okay will be six so we remove it add into the list okay and then uh, again now the length will be four only right so the larger index okay, uh, will be three and again i mean you can keep repeating the process okay you keep repeating the process okay yeah, i'm not going to bore you with that right okay so then you randomly pick one okay and add into the list okay same procedure okay yeah and then randomly pick one add into the list and then run then they pick one and then add into the list boom that's it so okay you have okay, a random permutation list okay, of uh, those numbers okay so now okay with this know-how you have then if someone give you okay this list of values then okay, can you okay, okay produce okay, a random permutation list the answer is you bet okay okay i mean because why because you have the knowledge okay, from here all right again uh, that is my whole purpose okay so uh, a lot of times uh, we in
instructors ask you to do something, uh, I know okay, we know that there are easier way, okay, but then we want you to okay, uh, uh, follow okay, some uh, uh, algorithms to solve it because we want you to have the what the know-how, okay, the know-how. Okay, all right. Have a good day. Okay, I hope that uh, this is useful to you. Okay, yeah, bye.